In this video, we are going to talk about recording in Zoom. As of now, Zoom meetings can only be recorded on Windows and Mac machines. You are not able to record Zoom meetings on a Chromebook. If you are using a Chromebook, please use Google Meet to do the recordings. In the upper left-hand corner, I can see that I am recording. If you don't toggle on the recording option before you start a meeting, you will see a button down on your taskbar that will allow you to record. So you can press that button and get going. Now, we're on top of the end of the meeting. So click End Meeting. And you want to select End Meeting for All. That deactivates the link. You will see a pop-up that says Convert Meeting Recording. Allow Zoom to convert your recording. If you don't do it now, you will have to do it later on if you are going to share that recording with someone. In this pop-up, um, I can see naming conventions for lots of my recordings, and then I see some that um, have been renamed. So at this point, I like to rename, and I do that by right-clicking on the highlighted uh, recording and then select Rename. I start typing right away. And then hit OK. I'm going to find all of my Zoom recordings in the Documents folder. So I'm going to go down and click on that manila file folder icon. And I'm going to go to Documents. And sometimes I click on Date Modified and that reorganizes my documents for me. And I'm going to scroll down and look for the Zoom folder. And you can see I have lots of folders. Every time you record a meeting, a folder is generated. Here is the folder that I renamed. And inside that folder are three items, okay? Two of which are super important. The audio only. So if you wanna share just the audio version of your um, recorded conference and zoom underscore zero this is the video one so you could also rename that if students were chatting so at any point in time if the chat option was being used then in this folder a transcript of the comments in the chat would be here as well. And as a reminder, all comments are transcribed. Whether they're private or public, all comments in the chat are transcribed. So just to repeat that path, go to your file folder, go to documents, go to your Zoom folder, and open up the folder that represents the recording that you want to look at. Okay. We have the audio only. If the chat feature was used, you'd have a transcription, and then you have your video. And remember, I renamed it video, but it's originally Zoom underscore zero.